Today's topic is nucleus. It is double membrane bound structure which is also known as brain of the cell. It was discovered by the scientist Robert Brown. If a cell has one nucleus, it is known as uninucleate. If two, it is binucleate. If many nucleus are present in a cell, it is known as multinucleate. And if there is no nucleus, it is known as anucleate. Examples are mature mammalian RBC, mature sieve tube that is phloem. This is the structure of nucleus. The outer membrane and inner membrane are comprised of nuclear envelope. The space between outer membrane and inner membrane is known as perinuclear space. Here is the thread-like structure which is extended and elaborate nucleoprotein fibers that is known as chromatin. At a number of places, the nuclear envelope is interrupted by minute pores. These pores are known as nuclear pore. And these nuclear pores are the passage through which movement of RNA protein molecules take place in both direction. That is bidirectional transport of material. The nuclear matrix is known as nucleoplasm. Nucleoplasm is semi-fluid in nature. It is transparent. It contains nucleolus and chromatin. Nucleoplasm is the site for mRNA synthesis. Nucleolus is non-membrane bound structure. It is site for rRNA synthesis that is ribosomal RNA synthesis. It is larger and more in number and actively carrying out protein synthesis.